I don't have the exact times. But it's usually at seven o'clock. So you'll want to get there at 630. OK, and it'll run till about 930 or so. If you look right here, this has a hotel. Now, I believe there's more than one hotel, but you see right here, there's two that are listed. You need to call them today. OK, call them today and reserve your room as the instructions show you Whittle Hierarchy. OK, make sure that you tell them that it's under the Whittle Hierarchy. That way, you know, you get a discount on your room. OK. Also, for the Fast Start School, I'm going to order tickets on Monday. OK, so if you want me to order your ticket, I'm going to order them in bulk. OK. And if you want me to do that, let me know and I'll send you the cash app of what it needs to be. And uh, we'll go from there. They're also going to provide lunch. And if you don't already have a team T-shirt for Saturday, let me know your size. Some of the RVPs have already sent that. Um, the dates aren't on here. May 26 and 27, Sean. They're on the bottom of the flyer. OK, Friday, May 26, Saturday, May 27. OK, now. Guys, I'm going to say this. Some of y'all been to a fast start school. Some of you haven't. You don't want to miss this event. OK, I'm telling you, I know that a lot of you in this in this uh, on the Zoom have been and you can vouch for this. But this is going to be one of the bigger events. We have Andy Young, who's an absolute legend in the company. He will be coming down. OK, this thing is it, big. Big decisions are made at big events. And I tell the people this all the time. If it had not been for a fast start school, I would not be in the business today. That's how much it changed my life. OK, so I want to make sure that you all understand the importance and we want to make sure that we're inviting people all the way up to the very end. OK, as many people as you possibly can invite them. Let's carpool. Let's make sure that if they need somewhere to stay, that we help accommodate that, guys. That's one of these deals where if you have somebody on your team that you think would be good, you do not want to let them miss e this event. OK, I'm just telling you that up front. OK, I can't I can I can't harp on that enough. All right. So what we'll do, like I said, now, what incentive that I am running, okay, anyone that does a thousand in premium, okay, a thousand in personal premium, or uh, one direct recruit before the event, okay, is going to get $50 paid toward their room, okay? One direct recruit or 1,000 in personal premium. So Camila, yes, Camila counts. Camila yesterday did uh, right at 1,000 in personal premium. That would count toward the $50 bonus, okay, toward the room, okay? Like for an example, but also I got Augustine who's got a policy that he's going to be doing this coming week or very soon. That will count toward his room $50 and even though he's not licensed yet or anyone that passes their exam, they will also get $50 toward their room, okay? So what we're trying to do is make sure everybody understands the importance of getting to this event, okay? Now, other than that, as far as the Fast Start School, Clinton, uh, I don't know if David and Keisha are on. Did I forget anything? Jay, anything that we need to reiterate? No. Um, if you do go and call the Holiday Inn, and when I called and made sure that there was a block, they said they were asking me if it was for the Whittle hierarchy. If for some odd reason you call Holiday Inn and they're they're not tracking Whittle hierarchy, you can just reference the Primerica event at the Crown Plaza. They will find it then. Um, but there is a block under Bill Whittle at the Holiday Inn. So, okay, all right, got it. So yeah, just make sure you're under that block. You want to get every bit of discount that you can. You want to leave with plenty of time getting into Baton Rouge, okay? Because um, there there is a little bit of traffic. But well, we just want everybody to be prepared. Now, the food situation, we'll, we're going to all up until the event, we are going to be reminding people of different things. OK, but we wanted to do this with plenty of time. My main thing is I want you to call today and be able to book your room so you can stay with everybody. OK, that's the main thing. We're going to continue to disseminate information. It's going to be, you know, it's going to be a, a information overload, but that's that's so we can get everybody prepared. OK. The other thing I wanted to say with this, guys, and, and we're, like I said, we're not going to be on here long. We have to really start paying attention to our attendance and our recruiting. OK, now what I want to do, I'm going to challenge each of you because I was talking to Quentin last night and Seth and different people. And we know that in this business, you know, sometimes people can be a pain. Right. Let's just let's just be honest here. Sometimes people say they're going to do one thing and then they do another. Sometimes people, you know, they, they, they promise the moon and then they don't even show up for a Saturday morning training. Guys, I'm going to tell you this. That's the business. That is the people business. OK, so understanding that that is the people business, it, it should help you become a little bit more armored when it comes to dealing with people. I'll say this, too. 
for the relationships that I have in this business. Okay. The fact that I get to, you know, uh, hang out with Clinton and go hunting or go, you know, go with Jay and, and spend time with Jay and give him Saints tickets. And, and Derek Simpson calls me yesterday crying because it's his anniversary and he made a $20,000 bonus. Those things about this business, you cannot replace those things. OK, I'm going to tell you that right now to be able to play a part in Camila going after her next goal or Danielle Bennett not having to, to, to work paycheck to paycheck. Guys, that makes it all worth it. OK, I'm going to tell you that right now. Yes, it's going to be tough. Like R. Williams says, yes, it's, it, you know, nobody said it's going to be easy, but they said it's going to be worth it. That is absolutely true. OK, so my main thing behind that, guys, is going into this next, basically the second half of the year. I'm going to do everything I possibly can to become the biggest recruiter in this organization with your help. So what I need you to do, the only thing I can't do and the only thing Clinton can't do and the other RVPs, David and Keisha, we only thing we can't do is go find the people. I can promise you we can recruit these people. I can promise you we can help develop a relationship with these people. It's just a matter of finding people. We need to go on a massive, massive prospecting uh, explosion. I want you to send me as many people as you can. If Camila's out and about today, maybe she's out shopping with her girls. Maybe she's out, whatever. It doesn't matter. Talk to somebody and ask them if they'd be interested in doing something else. Let me help you recruit them. I would do everything in my power to make that happen. Right. That is where we got to go. That is the most gratifying side, because if you want to get your next promotion, that's what it's going to take. Right. Finding new superstars. I was asking Jay this and we're going to wrap up. I was asking Jay this. I asked him, you know, what was the difference between last year's March Madness and this year's March Madness? And he yeah, he worked a lot harder. He was a lot more motivated, but he was working with people. He was working with Whitney and Ellis and now Denitra. So if you have a strong, strong work ethic, but a desire to push people up, that's how you win in this business. That is exactly how you win in this business. And that's what it's going to take, guys. So I'm all in. I'm sold out to it. Uh, the opportunity meeting, we need to see if we can get 40 in there. We had 25 the other night. We can get 40 this next op meeting. We're going to announce those dates before Monday. So like I said, just keep that in mind. But listen, one thing I'll tell you is I want to challenge every person to send me a brand new prospect their name and number before Monday. Okay. Just, I don't care if you got to go into a, to, to Popeye's like Tyler Craig did when I challenged him and ask for the manager's name and number and get it and send it to me. I don't care what we have to do. I want to do everything I can to recruit someone for you by Monday or Tuesday of next week, but I got to have the name and number. I got to be able to contact them. So, but guys, that's all I got for now. I wanted to hit on the fast start school. I wanted to hit on the recruiting side of it. If you have anybody right now that you need me to meet with as far as a fast start planner or to get them over the hump, please do not bother me. I'm, it's not bothering me. Please don't don't hesitate to send me that information. Seth mentioned something last night, basically saying, you know, he didn't want to because I'm busy. I am very, very busy. But my biggest my biggest use of, of value with time is building your team. OK, that is not something that I take lightly and that is not something that I'm going to forget to do. So wear me out. If you send me a recruit or a prospect and you haven't heard from me on if I've talked to them or if I've met with them, wear me out. That is not going to bother me. The only thing that bothers me is people tell me they want to win. Then they don't contact me to help them win. That's the only thing that irritates me. So please do not hesitate. OK, now what I want to do real quick. We're going to have this. Uh, Holly's got 400 numbers to call. Well, we got work to do. Mm. Call them today. Tomorrow's Mother's Day. I don't know if I call the mamas on Mother's Day, but today's not Mother's Day. So let's call them all, right, Vita? We're going to call every one of them. So, but hey, listen, I'm going to call these names out. There's some people where I can't see, uh, I can't see your name or whatever because it's on an iPhone. I'm going to call these names out. Anybody, any mothers that I miss, I need you to unmute and tell me that you're on, or I need you to post your name in the chat, okay? I have, right now, I have... Um, Amber, Holly, Vita, Chandrika, Anastasia, Camila, Brittany. Okay. Who am I missing for the mothers for the drawing we're about to do? Latanya. Latanya. Okay. All right. Anybody else? Anybody else? And Melissa just hopped on. Whitney. 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 I got Whitney. And then Melissa just hopped on. And then Clinton had his hand raised. So if you got to say, you can unmute Clinton if you had a question, he had your hand raised. No, I, I, I just have something to address once he does this drawing. Okay. You want to do it before or after, Clint? It's up to you, boss. 
Go ahead. Go ahead. Just, just two things. Just two things, real quick. Um, one, typically in the past, every time we go to these fast throw schools, guys, uh, we tend to have some stragglers come in late, and uh, there's other groups, other hierarchies that are that are taking the front row seats in our section where we're supposed to be sitting at. Let's try to go in as early as we as we can, as soon as the doors open, so that we can get to the front row and occupy those seats uh, instead of being spread out all in the back. Those of, you, those of you who have never been may not understand exactly what I'm talking about, but you'll see. But let's try to get to the front of the room so that we have the best view and we can support Mike and Mal and everybody else uh, being promoted. Uh, on top of that, get, uh, reiterating what Mike was saying about building the numbers, um, look, just because there's, there's a couple, just because you have an RVP doesn't mean that you should just rely on just them or Telegram to getting people on these calls. Um, I've done this in the past where, you know, it's, it's my fault and I, I've been, you know, I've, I've done it myself. When we do these Zoom meetings, uh, take the initiative for, for the people that you're building, you're recruiting, send those numbers to your RVP, but as well send the Zoom link out to them in a private text message asking them to hop on, like be part of this. Because if it's coming from multiple people pushing it, they're more likely to hop on than just seeing a notification on Telegram, hey, there's a Zoom meeting. Um, so just keep pushing for that. Don't rely just on your RVP to connect with them. Do it yourself. This is your team as well. Uh, on top of that, Mike, I don't know if you were going to address the Destin thing, the, the trip coming up, if you wanted to go over a few details with that, but that's all I had. Hey, thank you, Clinton. That's a great point because the reality of it is, first off, there's not the, 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 the there's not overload when it comes to people that want to win information overload that I don't think you can do that. Like whenever, whenever I was in Blake's base shop, I had my own team. Okay. Blake is a human being. He cannot hit on every single thing. Okay. Not one person can. Uh, that's why it's very important for, that's why I would sit to send out the information. I would make sure that the information was where it needed to be. I would make sure that we had the commitments to help Blake you know, because he's going to provide a training, he's going to run incentives, he's going to do bonuses. It is my job not only to plug them into what Blake is doing, but to make sure they have the information. That's a great point, Clinton. And then also with the uh, fast start school, you want to get there early. Like I said, 630 is, is pushing it, really. You want to get there a little bit closer to maybe 615 and, and, and make sure that you're in the room, right, because of all the different things Clinton just mentioned. The, thanks for reminding me the Destin trip. OK, I know you've probably heard about it um, on maybe some on one of the Zooms, but let me reiterate. OK, the top 10 below RVP are going to be included personal producers. And then there's three team. OK, um, right now, Jay McKinney is the only one that is qualified currently. Now, this is a four month competition. OK, so it's just started. Right. So you got plenty of time. OK, but the way it is scored is recruits direct recruits are a thousand points and premium is dollar for dollar okay so camila wrote a 50 dollar app yesterday and a 30 dollar app yesterday so she's got you know right at you know right at a thousand and in points okay if she gets a recruit that puts her at two thousand points you just add the two together okay now also correct me if, I, if i'm wrong but a direct license is three thousand points is that what he what he scores is that clinton yeah, I believe that's what you and Blake uh, spoke about as a, as a direct license. Direct code is 3,000. There was something else that qualified for 3,000, too. I can't remember. Well, I, I, don't, I, do, I do know that, that I've recommended the direct code. I don't know the exact points. And I'm going to post all this on Telegram. We're going to post it like crazy, but make no mistake about it. Listen, if you want to win this competition, okay, the recruiting and training those recruits is what's going to win this competition. Like right now, you take Brandon and Augustine as an example, okay? Augustine's about to pass his test. Brandon just passed his test, okay? My job and Clinton's job, my job is to help Augustine compete for this competition. Well, how am I going to do that? I'm going to get him promoted. We're going to meet with people. We're going to get him sales. We're going to make him money. Some people are going to want to join the business, right? So he's going to have sales and recruits. Same thing with Brandon. Brandon just got a direct recruit. He got a training sale with that recruit, got two direct recruits already. Okay. since So he's got 2000 points. So when he writes some premium under his license, bam, he's in the, he's right there in the mix. So my goal is to have at least five. I want to take half these slots from Alexandria and um, we're going to do everything we can do to make that happen. So, but yeah, and what, what I'll do too today, uh, I'm going to post the house. Now this isn't just some little condo. Okay. 
the houses that we stay on stay in in this deal are four or five million dollar houses okay um so it's definitely going to be some fun I'm, I'm pretty positive now that camila camila williams is back in the game that she's going to be taking one of them slots i don't think she has ever missed a uh a florida trip so y'all better watch out she told me she's coming for jay she just gotta learn how to swim though yeah we're gonna that's hey look I'm glad you brought that up. You have got to learn how to swim before you come on this trip. I don't care who you are. All right, we're going to learn. I got a pool. We're going to get out in the pool. We're going to teach you how, all right, because uh, we're going to rent some jet skis again, and we're not going to have the same thing happen that I ain't going to bring up. We got a picture of that somewhere. Let's put that on the Facebook page. Uh, uh, excuse me. I got to learn how to tread the water. I can swim. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen. I love y'all with all my heart. I cannot tell y'all get emotional. I have a hard time not getting emotional thinking about it. Uh, National sales director, huge thing. It's a very big deal. Y'all have all played a part in that, even from the brand new person uh, that's on here. It, it, it means the world to us. So I want to see y'all. We're going to do everything we can to help you grow your business. We're going to run competitions. We're going to go to Destin. We're going to pay for, you know, whatever we can do to help sell the dream so you can build your team. So thank y'all from the bottom of our heart. Anything else before I take this, uh, before I do this drawing? Anything else? All right, so what I've done, I have, we do this every year. This is the hat. This is the, uh, everybody's name is in there, okay? So what I'm going to do, whoever wins, can y'all see that I'm not cheating? I can't see anybody's face. Can everybody see that I'm not cheating? Everybody. Vita, can you see me? Give me a thumbs up. You see the hat? Okay, here we go. The winner is Anastasia Love. Congratulations, Anastasia. Yay. Now, what this wins, this wins you $50 towards your room at the Fast Start School. So as soon as you book your room, you text me, and I'm going to cash app you or Venmo you $50. So... Congratulations, guys. Like I said before, I'm going to be working all weekend. I want to fill up Monday and Tuesday with recruiting interviews, whatever I can do to help you. Listen, I don't care if I got to come to Natchitoches. I don't care if I got to come down to Pine Prairie or Ville Platte or Opelousas, wherever the hell Seth lives, wherever I got to go to find the next superstar and help you build your team, I'm going to go. So please use me up on that. I know Clinton feels the same way that I do, David and Keisha. We're all in this together, guys. Let's get Alexandria back where it needs to be. Y'all have a wonderful, wonderful Mother's Day. If you're like me and, uh, you know, your mother has – maybe you don't have a mother currently living, find somebody that you can uh, that you can show some love to, right? Shoot out a text message. Go give them a hug. Whatever you got to do because uh, Lord knows that, that these mamas are pretty serious – Pretty serious business, right? They deserve all the love we can give them on a, on a Mother's Day. So y'all have a great rest of your day. Holler if you need me. Love y'all.